morning. Monday the 7th. I can't believe how quickly the time's gone. Anyway, here's the plan. Starbucks, Knights Templar, plan the day, probably King Street. Or whatever comes up in the meantime. Breakfast. Open. And it's still Christmas. So, I had a bacon roll. And another bar is open. Nine o'clock. This is Distant Sun from Rusta. Free range beers apparently. 3.9% alcohol by volume. A lady brewer, I believe. <coughs> he says coffee. Watching the TV. Can't wait for Mr. Manning. Mm. Not much chocolate. But bitter. There's a hint of fruit in there as well. Okay, mm, chocolate maybe in the finish. It's pleasant. Mm, a really bitter, really bitter finish now. Or is it just my body? If there's a noise in the background, like that, well, that's the Christmas tree being cut down. Anyway, Otter Ale by Otter Brewery, 4.5% alcohol by volume, from Devon. Perfect, Mr. Manu. Oops. Malty. And a little sharp. Kingly. And a bit creamy, B+. Plus. From just down the road, Bar Fails, Golden Hair, 4.4% alcohol by volume. Effervescent, with a nice head. Malty, clean aroma. Hmm. Malty, dry body. Gently bitter on the finish. Two plus. Well, I think it's open. 12.01. It opens at 12. Oh, I love places that open on the time they say they would. Maybe slightly before. <coughs> Real wooden floor, Mr. Manning. So festive. Uh, nice tackle. Wood on site. King's. There's the brewery stuff over there. Um, uh, King Street Brewery. 4.8% alcohol by volume. The Wi Fi here. <laughs> yeah, no. Really. Multi. Full body. Fat fatty multi. Caramel. B plus. Um, atomic blonde. Who's on site? 3.9, 3 3.6, 3. I think it's Nancy Winston. Will, oh gosh, Wilson on the front on the pump clip. Hmm. Multi forward. Gentle amount of bitter. Quite nice. B plus. Famous Royal Navy volunteer. It says craft beer. It says white from true. Well, let's have a crack. Here's the question. Here is the list. Um, this is one of them. This is on keg. This is white from true red orange, 4.8% alcohol by volume. And there's a fire over there. Um, 
Slightly fruity aroma. Mm, fruity. And then there's a hint of rolling. Malty as well. Real wooden floor in Mr. Manning. I'm thinking deep pressing a bit. There are no pump tips here or any sort of beer identification. This is Subtropic by the Bissell Beer Factory, 4.4% alcohol by volume. Real wood flooring, I've done that already. Cask. Mm, smells a little bit fruity. Oh, very soft. Fruity. Bitter. Three plus in a bit. Well, there was one in Cardiff. And now there's only one. A small bar. Apparently card only. Apple pay, I'm gonna need you. Well, Apple Pay seems to be the way forward. Although I suspect Android Pay might help. Anyway. This is Parts Unknown by Left Handed Giant. 4.8% alcohol by volume. Very, very, very artisanal. Last time I was here, I sat over there and I had the vinegar incident. Nothing to do with me being Welsh. I miss the small bar in Cardiff, however, the Elzebub. Oh, yeah. Um, What's it taste like? Left handed giant, I think. Yeah. It's got that funky aroma, which is good. Oh. Sour, sipper, rather excellent. I know where I'm going. D. Small bar, big beer. Excellent, excellent glass. From the Pale IPA board, Bravo November by Red Cat. Let's come back, 4.7% alcohol by volume. White balance, ain't quite there yet. Mm, not much of an aroma. Ooh. Mmm. I don't know, but I don't know, B plus and a little bit more bit. B plus and a bit. <laughs> 